Hello, I'm Dina Titus, your representative for Nevada's first district in the heart of Las Vegas. I'd like to congratulate all of the winners of the Congressional App Challenge for your outstanding work. There were so many high quality entries from across the country. You and your parents and your teachers have so much to be proud of. I want to especially recognize Dylan Gowdy from Hyde Park Middle School for winning my district's Congressional App Challenge. This past year has been such a difficult one for students, teachers, and parents, and the app Dylan created, DigiNote, would make online schooling easier by giving students a new way to take notes. The fact that you put that all together and you're just in the sixth grade makes me so excited to see what you'll accomplish in the years to come. It's no surprise that many of the winners created apps to deal with the challenges that are presented by distance learning. That approach demonstrates exactly what STEM is all about, addressing difficult problems by developing innovative solutions. And if you all continue on this path, you won't just be helping out your fellow classmates. In the future, you'll be making improvements to our systems of healthcare, transportation, education, and government. Those of us who grew up in an era without smartphones in our pockets have a lot to learn from you. While I know I don't have the technical expertise to develop an app of my own, I do have a great appreciation and an understanding of the importance of your work. That's why I'm committed to making computer science education accessible for all. I'm proud to have supported the Building Blocks of STEM Act, which was recently signed into law to increase the participation of young women in computer science. But that's just a start, which is why I authored the Training Highly Skilled Workers Act to invest in scholarships for lower income individuals entering STEM programs. The bill would also provide resources for minority serving institutions to increase diversity in these growing fields. Those of you who have access to high quality STEM education are gonna be the next generation of leaders and discoverers. You will make the US competitive in the global market. You'll cure diseases and land on Mars. That's why I'm so grateful for all the hard work you put into the Congressional App Challenge, and I encourage you to keep it up. Congratulations again to Dylan and to all the winners across the country. You're great. Keep it up.